Well, my name is Sandy Henry, and I've been a member here at Our Savior since 1982, and I'm a retired employee of the Sioux Falls School District, so this is my fourth year retired, and I'm the grandmother of eight grandchildren. Last fall, I came back into contact with my friend June. And June and I graduated from high school in 1973, and it's because of our mutual friend Jim uh, connected us. So every night at 10 o'clock for 10 minutes on Facebook Messenger, we would just share how our day went. In that sharing, June said that she had to take a leave of absence from work as a nurse practitioner. And I said, well, what's going on? And Jim was the one who said, June needs kidney. And I immediately said, I'll give you a kidney. And she kept kind of poo-pooing it. She said, oh, you know, uh, are you sure you know what that entails? And I said, I am serious. I will give you a kidney. I felt a direct communication from God when I said, I will give you a kidney. It was this crystal clear message that you can do this and you will be okay. And if, you, if, you're not, if it's not safe for you to do this, Mayo Clinic will not perform the surgery. So I had total confidence in the process and the providers. And I felt like God was saying, you can do this, you can help June and you will be okay, everything will be okay. I've spent a lot of time since I've retired uh, reflecting on life and uh, really feeling so much gratitude for my life and that I've also really have been um, having the, a, a strong sense of the more you give, the more there will be of love and time, and I've just felt myself living that in the last four years, that, that that's just how life is. You know, waking up from surgery is, I've really never had a major surgery like that. So it was a little odd, you know, the bright lights and the kind of coming to and a little bit of pain and um, they got me settled in my room and the surgeon came in and said, you gave June a perfect kidney, a perfect kidney. And getting discharged, I was able to go see June, and she looked fabulous. It was night and day, even though she'd had this major seven-hour surgery, she looked so much better than she did when she went into surgery. It was, it was a true miracle of, in God's hands through these medical geniuses and I feel so grateful that I could help her. And, and I've said this many times, that I feel like I'm the one who's received. Gosh, the, the ability to help someone feels like receiving. What a powerful thing it's been for my family to be a part of this and to see this, the gift. It's been very moving for my adult children my grandkids too and June's as well. Mm -hmm.